Blistering strikes, caretaker's ally, and over encumbered. I do like a lot of this stuff. Caretaker's ally. Two costs if you get Nar, Kindred, Stena, Zyra. Blistering strikes. Look at the litter. It's gotta be this. Sell, sell, sell. Sell, sell. Sell. Sell, sell. Boom. 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 Boom, boom. No! No! And we give Garen items, I guess. This should get us a couple of kills, ideally. You never know, though. Oh, it's a win? It's a win? Okay, can we recreate that comp from memory? Aatrox? Zyra. There's a third... This girl, nice. So far, so good. Silas, Morgana, Galio. Great, great, great. Six units. Wukong, Rakan. Eight units total. Soraka, Diana. Beautiful. Gorgeous. Mint. He's a professional. Pumping up one. I mean. <clears throat> what are you doing with that Soraka, bud? Probably a cane guy. If I had to guess, it would be straight up just that guy's playing cane. Alright, let's win. Cool, amazing, fun. Awesome, unique. So good at just spitting out adjectives. It's actually my full-time job outside of being a TFT streamer. Starter pack containing one champions and one component. What? Oh, I saw these and I tried to memorize it. Arcanists? Whatever. Free cost. Your bench is full. That's right. What? I can't pick it up? Gross oversight game. I have to complain to people in my lobby. That's pretty disgusting. That guy's hilarious. Arms all over your face. <laughs> And then he muted himself. That's foul. That guy needs to go to jail. Alright, whatever. So... That was awesome. That was awesome. I really don't like this. I really don't like this. 
latent money on the ground. I could be making 40 right here. And instead I'm just getting cucked. Alright, this is our loss. Okay, that's fine. We were bound to lose at some point. Our comp was not actually that strong. We still made 40. There's really three champions in there? I chose three costs. There's actually genuinely three champions inside of here. Whatever. Who cares? Somebody's gotta... Somebody's gotta wonder. That's alright, it'll pop up soon enough. We'll get to the bottom of this together. Caretaker's ally, and he ripped a Senna, and he had Infinity Edge? He's the GOAT, dude. He's a GOAT gamer. You can always make uh, two crown guards on Silas, honestly. Not bad. Late game. Made 50, 88 HP, feeling pretty solid. Oh yeah, our portal was Tristana money, so pretty much everybody should have 50. Except it's just me and this guy. Pretty good, okay. These are trash. I'll pre-level. And then... Ooh, that's good. Don't mind if I do, buddy. No items. But we get rewarded with hecka items right here. And we get our three costs. There's some pretty interesting items, game. That's cool. You definitely want to play this at some point. Not in a rush though. Red buff on Morgana is fine later. Um, This is going to be an Ionic Spark. The rest of these items will probably go on either Galio or somebody else. Tiniest Titan Final Ascension New Recruit. New Recruit's good. Unleashed Arcana, Jewel Gauntlet, Rabbidon's Death Cap, Needlessly Large Rod. That fixes our items really well. I'll do it. Because <clears throat> this becomes this and this, and then you get to do that. And this is a Morgana item, probably. I don't think critting on Silas matters. I think you'd rather have more... More ability power, right? Could have taken Static Shiv. I don't hate that idea either. Loki Garen item holds pretty efficiently with these. Not efficiently enough, but still pretty good. Get him, Sivir! Get him, Gale, please! It's alright. We are quite healthy, brothers.
Yeah, I don't know. We have some massive item economy. Steadfast Heart is really good. With a potential Galio. That's not really important. Alright. I'll do it. Steadfast Heart improves the tankiness of the Diana. Wonderful. No real reason to play this stage. I think I really like this patch a lot, by the way, because of uh, how much it plays into how I'd like to play TFT naturally. Like, I don't have to make a lot of decisions that feel counterintuitive to myself. I feel like a lot of the decisions in this patch already line up with what I feel like I want to do in a TFT game anyways. And I feel like I want to get a sword here. Okay, there's no swords, that's fine. I think I want a belt here. There's no belts, that's cool too. More AP is never that bad, but I'll take that instead. Level 7, about where you'd like to be. Static Shiv's not good. Titan's Resolve's not good. Protector's Vow is fine. Obviously, the other item would be better. And now I'm always going to wonder, was plus one team size better? This comp really wants you to be level... Nine, because you have two five costs that you'd like to hit at the same time though hitting either of them is just as good as hitting the other one because they both substitute for the the diana really well right and we needed ap i don't know 70 HP going into a slightly fluctuating win slash loss streak. I'm sure the comment section is absolutely destroying me right now. Why do you have Jeweled Gauntlet on Sivir? Her ability already crits. Well, you're right. Maybe I should put Teemo in. Maybe I should take Soraka out. Maybe a lot of things. But talking and playing TFT at the same time is not very easy. In fact, it's actually kind of hard. But we're still making money. We're still getting rich. That guy is going to hit me for 11. Ouch. A pretty significant percentage of my health bar there, bud. Don't want more ribbons. It's kind of whatever at this point. These are my Morgana items. Uh oh. Oh, frick. This guy's gonna play the comp that I'm playing. Nice, though. This girl. Steadfast Heart again. Double Steadfast Heart, and then you can do blue buff on. Let's find out. Hold on. Don't don't slam anything yet, because you can still get 
Pandora's items, right? This guy is also randomly playing Silas. He's gonna start rolling right now, right? He's gonna realize that I'm also playing it. Okay. Bad luck, Chuck, right here. I forced it too hard, huh? It's okay. Yeah, I might have forced it a tad bit too hard. It's my mem my radiant item is more Morella Nomicon? Okay, frick. No, dude, my items are locked on the other side. Tier 1, Tier 2. Alright, we missed Silas. That's pretty rough. How many other guys are playing Silas is the question. We did not accidentally reroll our items, that's phenomenal. Redemption, that's cool. Bing bong. All above 40% health, take 30% less damage instead. Um er. We're basically only digging for a tank item anyway. I don't need this. I think uh, this girl's supposed to come out for the altruists. Actually, I don't know, actually. Because... Morgana's doing all the damage right now. Really, two star Aatrox is not doing anything right. Okay, so. What is this? Oh, two stars? Sword? I guess we'll take a Kench since we can replace it. One Silas out. Two Silas's out. All right, we should be able to find it, right? Nice. That's what I'm talking about. Here's the sword for this girl. Ionic, Crown Guard, Rabadonis, Switcheronis. Optimal positioning is this, this, um, backline, girl, free altruist, steadfast heart for the guy. Another crown guard can go on you. And yeah, you want space for another sage kind of but you also can't roll you can't do anything until you hit two star silas because watch out this gnar is about to kill everything this little dude gnar this little guy gnar he's gonna kill everybody holy frick disgusting we win wreck you dude what is it? What is it? What is it? 
a weapon from different armories. Take a support item. I guess... Phenomenal. If you position like that, everybody gets hit by it. Or if you position like... It looks weird, but I feel like that still works, right? I think I'd rather do this, though. Gets Silas one unit closer. Let me double check. One Silas gone. One Silas, just one. We already have Morgana. This guy's not playing Silas. This guy's not playing Silas. Okay, so two star Silas should be free. Especially since we waited until other people did their rolling and nobody else played Silas. I got scared for a second. Okay, proc, Galio? Oh, took too long. Took too long to proc on the Galio. dang -erang. Wait. Ooh. You ain't ever seen a Soraka do that in her entire life, have you? More Silas's? Cool. I'm feeling good. I'm feeling good about this. Exalted unit? Nah. Two Star Galio is a must, unfortunately. But he isn't so much of a must that we would be willing to frick up our comp for it. Some call me evil. Shall I prove them right? Fix the plan. Interesting. Protector's Vow helps Rakan cast faster. I don't hate that at all. Rakan's cast reduces damage, shields allies. All around, just kind of the goat for that, to be honest. Like, two Rakan casts should guarantee us at least not to take a million damage. That was definitely not the optimal location for a Recon cast, but sure. You're just gonna have to let me wonder about that one, I guess, game. Oh wait, oh wait, oh wait. My Morgana got his Morgana, and then my Morgana literally shot into a dead unit. What the F, dude? Thank you. Still made 50. No Galio pairs, so no choice. No chance we reroll for that ever. Component Anvil. A tier. Tier for who? Tier for Soraka? Where is it? It's in Narnia. Give me the tier. I'm gonna hurt you real bad. All right, whatever. There it is. Silas Gaming. Silas Gaming. Frick. Ghostly Gaming. Ghostly Gaming. Imagine we hit that girl one more time instead of the Shen twice. Would have been a world different. Oh, no. And it's probably not a W. Lord, have mercy. Lord, give me a Wukong. Please, Lord, help me. Ah. Ah, yeah. Radiant Spear of Hirana when you fight me, dude. Sure. 
You're not a cheater, I promise. Nice. You just... Oh, you got him again? Yeah, good job. No, you're a gamer, dude. You're you're just better than me. Radiant Spear of Hirana when he fights me. Whatever, we win. I'm tired of this Lissandra unit. Dominating my lobbies. It's disgusting. Bum ba dum ba bum ba dum ba bum ba dum ba bum. There's nothing to take here. Because I'm in fight or flight mode, baby. I'm in fight for a fifth kind of guy right now. And I barely beat that guy when he was probably at his peak with that spear for Ana. Wukong? Wukong? Wukong. All right. Oh, that guy. That guy. But that guy, though. That guy might be worth selling the Rakan for. Two Star Galio. There's only one Two Star Galio out. We could win. That extra sage point. Loki kind of doing us justice here. Extra Galio is probably much more impactful, to be honest. Ah. Hate it when that happens, don't you? Shouldn't I just chill? One turn. I think I need to do this. Dodge the Lissandra, very cool. Oh wait, just kidding. We might actually jump straight into it. Wait, but if she's not focusing, no, she potted the Silas. She always pots the Silas. What am I? Who am I? Who am I kidding? Don't die. Don't get potted. Holy fuck, dude. That unit is so stupid. I lived. I'm top four. Just kidding. Like and subscribe. <laughs> I'm sorry for yelling. I'm sorry. I didn't mean it, baby. Come here. God, Keith is... Keith is feeling weird. I don't know about that Lissandra unit at all, actually. I think I cucked myself because of the Aatrox, to be honest, though. None will escape my grass. Roll, 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 roll. Items. Who buff? All right. This is bad. We could have positioned the other way. We would have won this fight. Other way. I think this is a loss, boys. Appreciate you watching. Thanks for tuning in. Thanks for checking me out. If this Silas can one-shot this Shen, it's probably fine. However, the longer these fights go on, the more ghostly stuff happens, and we just destroyed his backline. Rawr! Got some good Morgana ults right there, that's what happened. Alright, it's just this guy we have to get through then, huh? We get through this guy, we win the game. He's four Sage.
No, we didn't hit. Okay, so his Silas is frontlined. Our Silas is backlined. We have 235 AP. He's got 223. Dang. He's got mucho more life steal. But we have the better guy, right? We 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 read the guide. Should have read the guide, bitch. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Oh, should've read the guide, bitch. Let's go. Top three. Hit him with that. Hit him with the donkey reference. Oh my god, we hit a Wukong? We hit a Wukong? Kale gives you 20 ability power. Wukong gives you heavenly attack speed and... Gives you 15 ability power. Oh wait, but you can't take out anything else. Okay. Minus Dragon Lord plus additional attack speed instead of... She get attack speed here and you get ability power from Soraka? I guess that feels pretty worth. And we got potted. Cool unit. Cool unit. Nice build. GG guys, like and subscribe. Thanks for watching the video. If you want to see more videos like this one in the future, make sure to hit that bell button, comment. Keith Ranger is the biggest fish in the sea in the comment section. Excuse me. Bonk. And rank check for the haters. Alright, see ya.